Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of the weapons of hot dogs, horseshoes and hand grenades. So today we are in Soviet Russia and we are going to take a look at this thing. This is a uh, big boy shotgun. It is a 23mm shotgun so I believe that's like 6 gauge or something. So well, what is the case for 23? Where does it have its origins and all of that? Well. It uh, was uh, request. It was made for uh, use in suppressing prison riots in Soviet Russia, and uh, it is actually uh, made out of "quote unquote" recycled materials in a way because the barrel is actually from uh, a 23 millimeter aircraft auto cannon. And of course, some of you might know the Russians love their 23 millimeter auto cannons in their planes, and some of these they just some of the barrels they just didn't past the requirements for the aircraft barrels. So since the shotgun lower pressure, well, pop it in a shotgun and uh, use it for uh, prison riots and have fun with it. So it does have an interesting side effect. So if we look down the barrel, you will see it is in fact rifled. And this rifling is then because it was an auto cannon aircraft barrel repurposed for a shotgun. Because this was made for prison riots and stuff like that, this did not see service in any military use. And mainly used uh, less less lethal and ammo and... Um, I am at a loss for words. And slugs. Uh, slugs, of course, because the bar rifling is great for it. Rifling is not great for like birdshot and buckshot and things like that. Great for slugs. And I don't know how the less lethal ammo works with it. But... Let's move that here. Let's uh, load up our shotgun. It takes one, two, three, three shells. Um, it is a pump action. So three in the tube, one in the chamber. It has a safety. Ah, there's the safety. Little. Uh, Thing at the end of a trigger guard and it comes with no butt plate or I have no stock uh, let's see if we can actually add one just uh, just to be on the safe side um, something that fits I think that fits yes yeah, so it does have a stock attachment point and you have this simple u-notch side and uh is it done safe now yes ah so when this is red when this red is showing it's not on safe so uh oops and it seems in game we have buckshot for this with a lot of spread i have to say But it works. And let's remove that stock. I said easier to do with my right hand because I am retarded. But anyways, here we go. So yeah, I mean, hey, it also has attachment. It looks like it has attachment point for a Russian side uh, um, side mounted optics. It actually does. So because this was a riot gun, I really or a prison riot gun, I really doubt they would actually attach attachments on it. It was made in like the seventies, I believe, by some company I can't pronounce because it's Russian. But hey, if you want to put your uh, Russian Cobra reflex side on it. For your uh, super accurate shotgun shooting. You can do so. No one's stopping you. The wonders of this game. Although I gotta be honest. Like. For a shotgun sight. This isn't too bad. Like this is usable. But 
But there isn't really much... Oops. Much more to say about it. It's uh, chambered in this 23mm cartridge. Some Russian text here. Can't understand any of it. Can't read Cyrillic. Uh, so yeah. I think that covers this uh, little uh, unique shotgun. Because it is unique. There is no other shotgun in this chambering. In the world possibly. Like even in real life. Like for sure in game. But maybe even in real life. Not only weapon. Because of course like I said. Barrel from a 23mm auto cannon. But. I think that covers this shotgun. So uh, I do hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe and all of that. And uh, I'll catch you next time. Bye.